A neighborhood meeting is underway in Metairie right now about the future of the Haynes Academy campus. Some neighbors don't want a commercial development at that site, and it all comes after the Jefferson Parish School Board voted to close six schools and move two of them, including Haynes. Haynes students will take over the former Grace King campus this fall. Lily Cummings spoke with Metairie residents and council members about what comes next. Haynes Academy for Advanced Studies used to sit on Metairie Road, a stone's throw from Muffin Bullard's home. I've lived in this house for 70 years. In April, the Jefferson Parish School Board voted to consolidate schools due to low enrollment. We totally support all of that, and we're, we're very much in favor of that. However, we have concerns as a neighborhood about what's going to happen to the area that impacts us. We have drainage concerns. We have uh, traffic concerns. The school board plans to demolish the former Haynes building and sell the roughly eight acres, leaving Ballart to wonder who will be her new neighbors. For Muffin Ballart, the ideal world is it remains a green space. That's why she's soliciting her neighbor's opinions and starting a petition for the property to remain residential. The parish council would have the final say in any zoning change. My personal opinion is it should remain residential. That is what that area is zoned now and what it's most suited for. Some council members say studies should be done for all of the former JP school properties to get ahead of whatever is to come. If we do a study now, determine what the community wants, and then when a developer tries to purchase the property, they know what they're buying. At this time, no one has purchased the Haynes property or asked for a zoning change. In Metairie, Lily Cummings, Eyewitness News. So the Jefferson Parish School Board says it doesn't have a timeline for the demolition or sale of that property. School Board member Clay Moy says he hopes it's done as soon as possible so they can reinvest that money into the classrooms. Moy says they've received a tremendous amount of interest in that Metairie Road property. It certainly is hot real estate.